Our CBSN producer, Caitlin Fish, is in Central Park in New York City. Caitlin is a budding meteorologist. So, Caitlin, give us a sense of what the conditions are like near you. So, conditions are actually a lot lighter than they were when I went out this morning. Everything is pretty calm as far as the snowfall itself, but we did just get updated guidance from the National Weather Service that says nine inches total have fallen in Central Park since around midnight last night, and everything seems uh, pretty calm at this point, but I know when I went uh, out of the house around 7 a.m. earlier, there was no visibility. Snow was falling so heavily, but now seems to be just fine. Caitlin, you know, New York City Mayor um, Bill de Blasio has asked people to stay off the streets. I see the sledders behind you there, but have people <laughs> stayed off the roads for the most part? I would say there's a lot less traffic on the roads, but he did cancel schools at the same time. So you do see a lot of sledders behind me, kids enjoying the day off of school. I know if, if I didn't have school, I'd be out here also. And Caitlin, uh, I, I'm guessing you probably walked from the CBS News Broadcast Center over to Columbus Circle, but there is yeah. a major transit line there. Uh, what's the situation with the subways and the buses? I've heard that the subways are running just fine. Uh, just residual delays from earlier today. I know the one train was having some issues getting around from where it is an outdoor train to an indoor train. But as far as the subways are, are running now, it seems to be just fine. And the cars on the streets are having a little bit of trouble with some spin out because you do have all of that gray, brown, slushy residual snow from earlier. But other than that, everything seems to be doing all right. All right. Caitlin Fish reporting mm -hmm. there from right here in New York mm -hmm. City.